Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. Inspired by the Mythbusters um, carbon dioxide and ice experiment, I decided to replicate the experiment on my own. Um, I have not designed the experiment as well as I'd hoped, though. <clears throat> um, I had dipped this glass, this glass here, the rim, in some uh, calcium carbonate otherwise known as baking soda. If you don't read Russian, there it is. That's baking soda. So I dipped it and then put it in a pan full of vinegar. And you can see, which surprised me, is that it looked like the vinegar in this one raced out of the glass. It looks like it's drier. Um, can't confirm that, but that's what it looks like. Anyway, the uh, carbon dioxide is definitely produced and it's trapped, theoretically, in this glass. So using common neon light, or rather um, fluorescent light, we will observe to see if there is a difference in the melt rate. Um, if we look at this ice cube, it's definitely tilting more than the other one. Size-wise, <laughs> um, I'd say that it looks like it's melting faster, but uh, we'll give it another 10 minutes, 20 minutes, see what happens.